Oh, well, so many things just happened. We had a, we had a, well, we planned out a Q and A that we were gonna do live on Instagram. We've been talking and about it for a few days, literally posting in, about it, and and then in the morning we got a little weird couple notifications about some posts about CBD vapes that were getting taken down, and then uh, we posted about some vapes a few days ago, maybe last week, a little reel about the vapes that we made, completely legal, nothing illegal about them at all. And this morning woke up to a notification saying, oh, this this post goes against community guidelines, blah, blah, blah. And then a store, the last that I put, something a yesterday came up as well. Oh as well. uh, yeah, we did another reel yes, well, last week about going to pick up your Rizla, but to pick up some papers in the shop and re-in up for the weekend. And that got taken down as well. So we had two violations in the last day, day and a half. Apparently we're like really <laughs> antisocial. Um, but nothing we're posting about is like illegal at all. Nothing um, illegal whatsoever. And like, yeah, I don't know. Oh, um, well, all right. And then, and then we tried to go live, and we got another nice notification saying. Literally planning all day what we're gonna talk about, <laughs> questions that people have been posing about Canna and all sorts of stuff, whatever. But we literally had our little script written down, like what we're gonna talk about, and trying to like um, just make a nice little vibe. But unfortunately, we went to live and the. Bleep, bleep. Yeah, no, that's so it's literally no, no freedom off. of speech on Instagram. Locked us off, man. So we can't do live at the moment. I don't know when that that will that will get lifted. Like we've had it in the past, actually. Like we used to do lives in the shop and play actually, music, and um, yeah, because we had like quite a few like violations about copyright. Um, they ended up locking our our live off as well which got reinstated, but now we've been blocked again. So we're going to have to l not do live for a little while. I don't know what we're going to do, but maybe we're just going to record these videos and just post these as little yeah. IGTV sort of things or, or YouTube stick it or on some, YouTube. Something yeah. like that. Exactly. And like, I mean, we wanted to do it for a long time. We had, like, I don't know if anyone watching this will remember, but we had a little podcast going for a bit. There's still a couple episodes that we want to, <laughs> we actually do want to post <laughs> still. But we kind of wanted to get back to that kind of like talking level, yeah. And like we wanted to, I don't know, we get a lot of questions. We always want to be interactive with our customers. Not everyone can make it down to our shop, so just create some dialogue with you listeners or you people that have come to the shop and bought stuff or people that know us from just whatever being around on the scene a little bit and yeah, just just creating some dialogue between us and you. And if people have any questions or anything that you want to speak about in regards to the kind of CBD, the business how to sell online, that kind of stuff. Just anything surrounding Canna, basically. Um, if we know the answer, obviously we'll, we'll, let, us, we'll let you, let you know. You can ask us anything, really, though. I mean, we can go and do a bit of research and work out so if, if it's stuff we don't know about. But, yeah, obviously we're not like the Oracle. We don't know everything. Yeah, we can look for example. We can give, like, I don't know, we've been doing this, like, all of us have been involved in this for a long time. And not that we know better than other people, but, like, we've gone through a lot of like trial and error products that we've made and with customers that come into the shop and like f like not just finding a product that works for them finding out why it works for them and yeah. then being able to like, f like i don't know we, we we're like we're kind of like quite like since opening the shop like quite we've geeky gone, with it we we've are. gone through so many different products some have really worked well in the shop some have sold sold like crazy some just do not work as well some are very gimmicky yeah like everybody's putting cbd in everything these days so yeah. like you don't necessarily need a cbd but peanut butter when you could just take the cbd right. oil and put it under your tongue yeah. so and i think what leon touched on as well like people take cbd for so many different reasons and yeah. so many ways of taking it and things you can take in it with that we're all about working with our customers and, mm. and our base to, to find what works for them and help them on their journey exactly cbd is not a destination for us like and you hear you end up hearing the same things over and over again like the same like people coming in saying they feel a certain kind of way and it's very similar to someone else who came in last week saying almost exactly the same lyrics and it's like you do start to figure out as well start making like, the connections isn't oh, it? what's working for people and, and what's we, effective and that and then we do our own research like Lo literally speaks Turpanese I'm the interpreter he's an interpreter that's what his nickname is in the, in, in the office anyway yeah. just respect the Terps people respect the Terps <laughs> <laughs> but we, that's like I don't know we're really starting to like enjoy getting a bit geeky with it and like I guess we're not we're not cocky, but we're very confident in our products. Like we're very confident in what we put out because we're like we like to think 
we like to think that we're not just like some guys chucking up something together to make some money. Like we're yeah, actually no, like we, we spent time on the products that we've released, like branded as other side products. We've spent time working out the ingredients, what goes into it, and not trying to make just a generic product that everyone else has made. Trying to make it like so it's individual to a, to a, to a certain level that is other side. It's not like no one else has got it at all. And, so, and it's like it's been really fun it's been stressful but it's been really it's been, really it's been a mad stress it's, it's been stressful but it's, it's, it's been fun but it's also been really interesting and mm. like us three like we proper love the whole like everything behind the plant everything it can do like we're really big into that and we know that a lot of people like we have people that come in the shop and literally we end up having a chat with them for like 45 minutes it can be about just anything to do with the plant and like even if they're not buying something just like other people with a similar mindset so we're like we're trying yeah trying to like expand that community community and just show that like i guess like there's people in the can of scene that aren't just like naughty people it's like, not just stoners it's yeah. not just people that want to just yeah. yeah not do nothing it's not just criminals and all that side of it unfortunately they are criminals because chc is still illegal but yeah, there's a whole array of people from professionals to people that just want to relax a bit in the evening. Like just athletes. Yeah, athletes, like, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Like Just like normal day to day people who like society is ingrained into them that having a glass of wine or a beer after work is like. That's fine. That's but fine, but actually, there's so many things on nature already naturally has. Provides. Yeah, so always, we're like, yeah, I guess, guess we're doing like a <coughs> QA type thing, but. We'll post it, so it end up being almost podcasty vibes. Um, Excuse me, that 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 Delta Eight is a tickler. <laughs> yeah, <he's, laughs> literally, he keeps getting these turp sneezes. Literally, <laughs> like there's a woo, there's a proper tingle there. Oh, anyway, um, so, so yeah, what should we do? Should we just go through questions, or do you want to just? Well, I was gonna say next week as well. We just uh, while yeah. we're trying out some Instagram different lives and stuff trying to whip up, figure something out before we got to this point so we might even like we said we might do pre-recorded videos like this but we'd love we'd rather do live so we can interact with people at the same time of course but I you may do like sections that are recorded like this so we can talk about the questions or and then go on live afterwards and just be, maybe whoever's posed the question will jump jump on live with us um, i mean ideally we'll be get to a point where we're on like something like twitch or on our mixed cloud or somewhere like that where people can like type in the chat and like everyone can see the question everyone can like that's the, that was the idea on instagram yeah. but and then uh, right today. yeah and i mean we we would like to do it with other people as well like feature like friends and like we'd like to get people on board with us and not make it just like our three mugs just chatting the same weed shit every week what we could probably do actually <laughs> is maybe this could be a little intro video next week we do the questions we've got quite a few we will build up quite a few and we can just rattle through a load um Rather than now going after all this 10 minutes of ch waffle. Now start, <laughs> now start doing questions. I think maybe this is a little video just chop well, it out like this. Well, we can like so maybe, maybe talk a little... What are you saying, bro? Yeah, this dog is getting well involved right now. He's been in the office all day and he wants to go and run or go home or go and chill or whatever. But look at him, just getting a bit needy. Wait. He wants to go. Meet Pancho, by the way. Shot mascot. Isn't it? Give me five, bro. I guess we can... Nice one. Stay. <laughs> <laughs> But I guess before we go, like before we go, 